Hey guys, <coughs> a little update this time not at uh, midnight but uh, a little bit earlier during daytime, it is better. Just to share with you a slightly uh, a very small update but uh, nevertheless it's an in important aspect of your life support system. This is a monitoring of the temperature, more precisely of the heating system. It is important, I guess it's quite easy to understand because if for any reason you uh, mismatch something between sensor for example and the heater then you will cook your fish and um, there's a times to times fish keeper to who uh, did happen it did happen to me 20 years ago something like that uh, <clears throat> and it was because of a broken heater in the tank it was at this time i guess uh, a i'm old e i'm uh, heater with a glass tube you know and uh, it did broke and uh, <clears throat> A little bit water inside turn on the heater non-stop meaning that yeah my fish dead uh, died so by the way uh, due to the fact that we have some quite uh, interesting slash uh, uh, not so easy to find slash expenses expensive fishes uh, it was important to me to set up something robust a little bit more robust instead of uh, the tubing of glass with the sensor and the heater in the same system I switched to a sensor system um, quite um, decorrelated to the heater the heater this is aquamedic uh, titanium heater whatever this is a, a tube very strong you can let it uh, on the um, on the falling on the ground it's not breaking anything and uh, the sensor aspect this is this inkbird system okay <clears throat> and the little upgrade of today this is from this model ETC 306T towards the ETC 306A <laughs> so I don't know with the terminology <clears throat> but the old one this one this one this is a new one or let's say it's a little bit more advanced feature one uh, you do have an improvement on two aspects <clears throat> between these two models. This one, this is the old one uh, coming from the Trophyus tank. Uh, this is why it's uh, a lot of uh, calc quite a bit everywhere. <clears throat> the sensors are quite the same as you can see between both models. So you have the sensor, you have here the possibility to have two heater. In fact, it's not necessarily two heater, but it can be also something to warm up the water, something to uh, cool down the water, especially in seawater system. You may have a cooling system on your tank. In our case, it's just a heater system. So you can use both of them if you want as well, uh, I guess, in heating system. <coughs> and the two main differences, the first one quite important uh, for my decision to upgrade this is to have two sensors meaning that at one point if the system detects uh, a too big difference between the two sensors you receive a warning and this is a second advantage of this system or a great you receive a warning on your uh, smartphone directly because it is a connected uh, monitoring system uh, you have to set up the Wi-Fi to this um, through the apps in your smartphone and uh, you will then be able to receive a warning on your smartphone even if you are not at home. So I have to unset up this one and to set up this one. <coughs> Currently as you can see I already told you this is, is coming from the Trophyus meaning that I already upgraded the Trophyus system. <coughs> Thanks Sony for the screen saver over there. <laughs> um, this is a basic system. The previous one did this uh, also digital display of the temperature, the target one and the current one. And uh, I would say, <coughs> other than that, the length of the cable are quite similar. Uh, I just have to set up, you can see here, bifurcation, you have the two sensors, one is going here the other one is going here so they are both going in the sump of course uh, so i'm more monitoring the temperature of the sump meaning that for example during a water change uh, i don't um, measure the temperature of the tank during the water change because the sump is uh, 
working alone, I would say. But in the same time, the heater is here, so it does make sense to monitor the system here. <coughs> By the way, you can see the filtration a little bit more since uh, the sump is completely open. Huh? Mechanical filtration, biological filtration, with a moving bed sterilization, with UV lamp here. Here you have a, a card bridge a filter, a chemical, a chemical filtration, a pre-filter for here uh, to let the phosphate absorber working fine. Here this is a silicate absorber working fine. And I guess that's all. And here this is the auto top off system plug over there on automatic. You have two automatic uh, smart plugs that you can see. This one, this is the auto top off, um, uh, the smart plug for the auto top off. This one, this is the smart plug for the uh, paper, roll paper filter that I can maybe show you a little bit more. If I can get it here, up like that, up, up. So here are the sensor. If you are wondering, as uh, a smart plug is something okay that you can program uh, based on the time, but in fact it's not based on the time. This is based on some water level or water leak sensor. So that's all for today. I tried to make it quickly and uh, regarding the trophies this is uh, the good news uh, we are on the third day without a uh, fourth day without any dead and uh, this is uh, excellent I would say maybe the first time that I, I succeed uh, with some medicine to uh, make a change to make a difference in such kind of fish so it's cool and here are the two models if you are wondering the price of course this one I guess I get it uh, 30 euro and this one I got it few weeks ago special on Amazon uh, 35 euro otherwise they are costing 50 euro something like that so it's not so expensive I would say and this is definitely a good invest on the little app of your smartphone you can set up everything so I don't have to play anymore with the digital display and the button I can uh, set up everything in the smartphone this is cool and this is a must have I would say in the definition of the material on our website as uh, a suitable slash ideal material for you to not worry and for your fish to have a, a nice life definitely something on the list that's all guys hope everything is going fine ciao